and we're back, folks. Yeah, I've got to say that. I can't help it. But we're heading off into the next dungeon of Chapter 7. Fortunately, they want us to play with our new toy. So they give us plenty of hearts to fill up our health with. It's not, it might not be enough sometimes, but fortunately it is. This is what I like about the Supernova. It goes the length of the screen. If you have this, it, it definitely makes things a lot easier if you can keep your health up. Of course, this also means that if there's anything that you encounter that can take away even the slightest amount of health, that then you have reason to be terrified, but especially because of your health limits. But fortunately, it's generous. As long as you have, I think it's above, above the first line or below... As long as your entire top is filled. Yeah, and as you see, they're a little bit more subtle with the walls now. A little. Yeah, totally. Just checking for anything else while I cleared the room. Medicine. I'm trying to remember what the boss is. Yeah, you know it's a long-reach weapon if it's beating out the greens on, on wow, distance. Wow, like yes, they do that constantly. What the hell? It's not. It's not. It's not. I don't know if it's a sprite glitch, but they do that constantly. This was in the original game. It's not just the ROM. It's not Skype or the ROM script. It is general white standard behavior. Wow. Well, they're moonwalking shoes. Come on. Thank you, Mike. Yeah, for you don't walk off into the abyss or jump. <laughs> well, it won't let you walk off. That's we'll a that's jump. a plus, you know. Well, I mean, you're, you're prepared Oosh. for a jump, so I'm going to jump the right spot. Yes, you will have to jump those. Oosh. But that's okay. Yeah, they... I don't know why they do that. I, I'm guessing it has to do with hit stun or whatever, but... But I really can't be sure. Get my supernova back. And no, I don't have to deal with these guys. And because they can damage you, it's usually not recommended. Just run for the teleport and get out of there. But then we enter this game's version of Bullet Hell. Fortunately, they'll never cross their bullets, so therefore... If you dodge, if you dodge out of the way of one, you can usually dodge out of the way of the other. But you have to kill them all. And now we encounter these. The aliens answer to bat. But we find this. A weapon I don't think is... Oh. Well, none of the alien weapons, for that matter, are ever mentioned mentioned in the manual, at all. Of course not. And I'd rather kill green first, thank you, because we have vitamin X. Actually, vitamin X is mentioned in the manual. Oh, I forgot I can destroy these. Oh well. I'm under Vitamin X's influence, so... And now we get this Lightning Trouble Maker. <laughs> Your weapons can't go through them. <laughs> Your weapons can't go through the lightning. And now more fun! They can't ride the lightning? Well, that sucks. Well, that just means we're not playing 13. And that does not suck, then, okay? Damage. I, I hate 
hate this barrier. You thought you could sneak up on me. Oh shoot, the red ones are loose. These, unlike, the, unlike their counterparts, can actually shoot while flying around at random intervals. And despite the fact that it looks like it, no, there is no secret here. And we encounter a boss of sorts. And since I let my, I wound up getting power down. Fortunately, he's a bit wide, so. Yeah. You just have to dodge the bullets. He only he only shoots as he's flying back and forth. Fortunately, he's not that bad, as you see. I probably just made him look, wind end up looking a lot worse than he is. And yeah, you found, you see that. An empty secret room. <laughs> Why? <laughs> and since I'll have to fight him again, let's just bl blast this open for an actual secret. Might as well demonstrate this thing. What it is, is a highly powered gun that actually shoots to the side slightly of your tile. Making it wonderful if you're trying to catch someone in just that that one spot. And also since great for these, well, I might as well say it, bat replacements. If I can hit them. And yes, you heard the sound right. The, the the game's answer to those to those drop you pits. Oh yeah, you thought. Yes, you see this right. You've got you've got to run along. And jump up and down with the tiles. So are they damage tiles or they? Yes, they are. Pits or the, okay. A lot of damage. Oh, oh, this. Oh, I remember this boss. This one is a little bit unusual. Uh, if I could actually get to it. I should. I. I did. I forgot I had the medicine. But, but that's okay. That's okay because you didn't have the power to lift. That would have made it worse. It wouldn't have mattered. What, playing this game with the power glove wouldn't matter? Are you, sh are you sure me? I wish I was, but for that boss fight, no, it doesn't. I wish I was kidding, but... I'd like to see uh, extra, extra hearts are nice, but you don't need it for that fight. Fortunately, they do move slow enough, and it is, as you see, a pattern. Oh, yes, certainly. Just... Okay, let me save that then. But yeah, I have to get up in his face. I just don't want him stepping on me, though. That's instant death. I want to step on his little button. And as you'll see, yes. I wound up causing a pit behind him. Yep. All the more reason why I want distance, but there. Or you know, you can kind of fade out and we'll pretend you don't do a bad short. You take what you can get. <laughs> oh, NES, well, you were trying, <laughs> so I'll give you that, NES. It's not your fault, so. But yeah, that's the end of the second dungeon, and you saw the cube for a brief moment up there. <laughs> this one has. This one has a, another important upgrade from it, of course. Uh, of course, you'll have to bear with me, because I don't remember the exact path of stairs to take. 
Oh, of course, not enough to walk on. This has to be. This is unknown dungeon, basically. This is Mewtwo's cave. <laughs> well, there are no random battles, so really, this is just annoyance. Well, I mean, well, I mean, like the basic premise of the, uh, the moving around, but I mean, yeah. Yeah. Try and remember which staircase it is. If I remember the uh, the tiles can kind of form kind of a funny L L I if I recall. Oh no, I is not first. I'm almost positive it's L L I. Or not or was it I? No, it was right. I was right the first time. I'll remember. Don't worry, I'll clear this before 15 minutes are even up. <laughs> I forgot this okay. on that one. <laughs> well, I've got four minutes left to go, so... Oh, I was I, I shouldn't have corrected myself. I was, This was the wrong staircase. Uh, yep, definitely covering all bits on that one. I've got four minutes. I can make it. There's a strong possibility. And then crash. <laughs> no, we're, we're, not not this, we're not using net play this. We're not using net play this time. There, it won't crash. <laughs> no, I mean like your own computer. Oh well, that's another story. Exactly. All right. Was it down or up? Yes, I know I'm tooting bait. I'm sorry, people. Is it? No, wrong one. Still a nice catchy tune, something. <laughs> At least it's decent music to listen to. It's not constant. It's not constant warning klaxons or something like that. Wait for the inevitable raw mag to steal this music. If, 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 if you can run to a Mega Man raw that takes music from. Oh, I don't know, Pokemon TCG of all things, then apparently anything is fair game. <laughs> I just didn't expect that. I really just hey, don't you go making my, my taking out my fair game. It's perfectly fine. <laughs> Air, before the 15 minutes are up, finally. And the most important upgrade. Yes. I just wish it wouldn't take this time filling it up. It has to be a faster way. And later you'll see that this was utterly pointless. Okay. I'm not sure why getting, uh, Maxi on yard is pointless, but okay. Well, well that referring to? that's what I'm referring to. The reason is because of the fact that this is basically the end of the chapter, so you get reset to three hearts in the next stage. So yeah, well, there is no point. Hearts, oh, your max hearts remain the same, but so why take the time though? filling them up? Oh, that part, filling up. Part and it's a nice up. aerial view of the of the island you were on, as well as several other islands. It's not darker well as UFO, but I guess it'll do. <laughs> I don't know, it's what it really reminds me of. Clearly the aliens are lacking eyebrows. No <laughs> they can never be Dr. Wily. Here, by the last magic cube. No, no, it's a warp cube. It's going to be Final Fantasy 1, I know. Like. And now, a conversation from the evil emperor. <laughs> That's illusionary imagery. How do you know it's illusionary? Zoda, okay. <laughs> okay, then. Zoda. Well, it's only three hearts at the moment. That might be true, but we're probably going to have more by the time we get there, so... <laughs> Good job, bad guy. I couldn't find this right here now, and it would have been smart to. The villains just never think ahead. I've got to wonder. <laughs> Such short, a short-sighted... No. Just... There it is. You champ bananas in here. <laughs> and that actually works. 
I was gonna say I know what the final dungeon can be like, so therefore I think we'll pull. I think we'll stop here, yeah, and then resume and hopefully beat it in the next video.